Lisa Hammer is a tool that you use to dazzle the world with. <laughs> uh, Lisa Hammer is my wife as well. She's also the lead singer of the real band that is featured in the web series called Radiana. I was in a, a few bands in the 80s and 90s. I was in a band called Requiem in White in Boston. We moved to New York and we did really well. We used to play CBGBs and the limelight and all kinds of crazy things. About 1994 we broke up and we formed more syphilitica. Syphilitica was another goth band that went until about 2002, until I moved out to Los Angeles. And I had a great, wonderful singing career with these bands. It sure felt good to be bad. MTV Online describes their video, Dreams of the Mini, syphilitic death, sex followed by a slow descent into spiraling madness. The original lineup for Radiana that ended up just being a studio band uh, was myself and Stephen Deal. We were the composers. We wrote together. Uh, Stephen Deal was one of my best friends in the world since the 80s, back in the New Haven, Connecticut scene. He just made you feel better. Just being around him made you feel like nothing, nothing could go possibly wrong. Oh, I was just in a fight, see? Uh, <laughs> oh, what a horrible accident we were just in. Oh my gosh. And make you don't you worry. One night he turned to me and he said, well, You've been in Requiem in White, you've been in More Syphilitic, you've done all this stuff, and I've been in Chopper and Bleach Black and Absolute Zeros. Why have we never played together? And I looked at him and I was like, I don't know, let's start. <laughs> One night at four o'clock in the morning, uh, The Invisible Heart was born. In battles between the invisible heart, the eyes of the people And he would play these this genius, just raw kind of rock punk riffs. And then I would bring in almost my like Gregorian <laughs> chant kind of vocals. So I was bringing these crazy weird harmonies into it and it was meshing. It was really symbiotic, it was really nice. That is all I say. And so we made a CD with the help of Dan Kohler on bass and uh, as the engineer. And then unfortunately, uh, Stephen Deal was diagnosed with cancer. And he, uh, he passed away. So this is really for him. I'm just happy with Radiana to keep Steve's music alive. Because it's worth keeping alive. And if I can alert people to the genius of Stephen Deal, then I'm happy.
I'm, I'm, done, I'm done playing that number. I don't know how I look. Don't make me look fat in the video. Oh, mother, that's just egg paranoia. <laughs>